Hey goddess babes, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shonda and today we are gonna get into it with a Shein spring and summer swimwear haul. I am so excited for the spring and summer. I think this year we'll all be able to get out a little bit more, go a few different places. If you are ready to take a look at some different options for spring and summer swimwear, then make sure you keep on watching because I got a bunch of different items from Shein that I think you'll be interested in seeing. And if you haven't already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to the channel. You'll love it here in the goddess community. And if you like this video, make sure you like and leave a comment. Let me know what your favorite look was. But without further ado, let's jump right into the video. Before we jump in, I have a special surprise for you guys. So this portion of the video is sponsored by Rose Forever. Now, of course, you know, Mother's Day is coming up. And so I thought this was just a perfect, perfect gift for anyone, yourself. Sometimes you gotta give yourself to get self a gift, but also, of course, for any moms that you know that would definitely deserve the roses, give them their roses now. And I love, love, love this entire set up i just love having roses in the house especially in the bedroom just to kind of give a nice romantic feel and so now i don't have to worry about roses dying because i hate when they die i hate throwing away roses but these will last at least a year and so i'm super excited about that and i absolutely love that it has the little jewelry tray underneath so you can add your jewelry to it and then i love that the cover comes off so that way you can actually see the roses such a beautiful beautiful presentation definitely a beautiful gift as a thank you to my audience they are giving you guys a coupon code for $15 off just use the code big brown goddess 15 that will be in the description box as well so that way you can go ahead and order your roses they have so many different choices to choose from they sent me these in the acrylic box but they also have suede boxes and mirrored boxes and all kinds of different options that coupon code is good for 30 days from today now for what you came here for let's take a look at some swimwear this one i'm starting with i actually really like this a lot so it's a three-piece set um, it comes with this tool skirt, which I think is the star of the show, but it also comes with the two-piece bikini set with it as well. So as you can see, this is a halter that it comes with. I love because it's got the little cute little detail in the front. It does have the inserts. I wish they were a little bigger because they're about this big versus being more coverage there, but I think it'll work because it doesn't really seem to be very see-through. Of course, you got the see-through on the bottom with the skirt. I was a little hesitant to order this set because there was mixed reviews and I see why now. So the 2X, the top part fits well, but the bottoms, because I got a little bit more junk in my trunk, <laughs> I feel like the bottoms should have been a little bit bigger. So I might would have sized up. I might recommend sizing up in this one um, because I have this one pulled up just to make it look a little bit better, kind of like the Empire waist. Um, but I think what you're supposed to do is wear it more like around the waist here. But for me, that doesn't really work because it cinches in too much. As you can see, it kind of rolls up. And then the bikini bottom underneath, I don't know if you can see, but it's just a little too small. It's not really, it's not really giving what I needed to give with the rest of it. So with pulling this up, it does help to kind of give you the shape, or at least for me, the shape that I like, but the bottoms, I would like a little bit more, I don't know, to be a little bit more flattering because it's, it's not cutting off anything. I just like it to be a little bit better fitted. So again, I think I would probably recommend sizing up. So this is what I mean when I say I don't like the way it kind of cuts off because it's creating a muffin top. And me personally, I like things that are a little bit more high waisted, especially if I'm gonna have my stomach out um, because just to kind of give the fupa a little bit more of a pleasant look to it, I will free her as I said before but whenever it comes to wearing a two-piece and just feeling more comfortable i do prefer it to be a little bit more high cut so this right here how it kind of cuts off at the waist not a huge fan of the top does not have anything to tie here so hopefully this part wouldn't get too big for you 
again because it's the halter that you can of course adjust as you need to i love the look and the idea is just the execution on the bottom part for us curvy girls it's not quite hitting where i wanted to hit but overall it's a cute look let me know what you think in the comments okay it's a yes for me <laughs> Where do I start with this one? I will tell you when I say that I don't like the way the two piece hits kind of down here, it's because I think this is a more flattering style for us curvy girls, at least for me anyway. So I really like this swimsuit. I love the color. I think it's such a beautiful color. Again, you guys know that this year is all about the bright, bold colors. And of course this orange understands the assignment. So might feel like a highlighter at the beach. But it's okay <laughs> because you're going to see me and I think that's what this swimsuit needs is to be seen. So with this one, I love because it does have the one strap here. I will say it makes it feel a little bit awkward because there's no, I guess, support on this side. But I don't think I'm going to fall out anywhere. I typically don't do a whole lot of heavy swimming anyway when I go get in the water, so I think I should be okay. I do love, this is actually a one piece set, but it has just the attachment on the side here and it's open on this side. So what that means is you actually kind of still get in it like you normally would a bathing suit, but it does have the separation here. So I guess if you wanted to, you might could pull it up more. I really don't feel comfortable doing that, but I also don't think it needs it because one thing I love most about this bathing suit is that because it is just a little bit of a cutout opening here, you could feel a little uncomfortable if you had the rolls kind of on the on this side, but because you have this little piece that ties in the middle, kind of helps to give a little bit more of a camouflage, I guess, so to speak, for that side roll. So it makes it look super cute. It kind of helps to make sure everything is nice and flattered. I am just a really big fan of this one. This one actually comes up high here, which I love how high it comes up there. You can actually pull it down so that way it all looks like one piece there, but then you got the tie in the front. So I think this one is super cute. Let me know what you think of this look. Okay, Queens, I am so in love with this look. Oh my gosh, the color, it's the color for me. It's the comfort for me. This one is so comfortable and it feels like such a high quality material. It's not thin at all. It's definitely a good thick material, which I think makes it very easy to be flattering on the curves. Um, I love, of course, that this one is another three piece set. So the kimono that it comes with is so cute. Look at this pattern. Okay, this is the perfect spring look because of course this kimono the kimono is actually pretty thick too um whatever this material is it's more of a silky kind of material which i think it make easy so that way if you do get it wet it'll probably dry pretty quick but so you don't feel so chilly if you get it wet and of course like i said i love the color i love the fit it feels a little snug on the arms but not too much where i wouldn't feel comfortable so and then I am only 5'2", and as you can see, this one just kind of barely touches the ground. So for my short beauties, you're good. For my taller babes, this one might come up a little bit high, depending on where you like for yours to fall, but I think overall it should be okay. And then of course, if you're bustier up top, I think you might be okay a little bit. If not, again, um, I'll put my, my uh, size in the description as far as my cup size and things like that. But one thing I do love, of course, you got the tie in the front, which makes this nice little circle here, which is super cute. But then also I love because the straps are adjustable. So I was a little worried at first, but then once I realized that these were adjustable, then I just adjusted them and everything lifted the way that they needed to. So anyway, I love that this is a short two piece set. So for anybody that's a little bit hesitant to wear a two piece girl, rock that two piece, okay? pull them curves out, and if you feel more comfortable, wear the shorts with it. Hopefully, it'll work for you. So let me show you guys the rest of it. So here's the set without the kimono. So of course, as I mentioned, you do have the shorts. They do fit really comfortable. I love because they're coverage. Again, I have all this back here. It's not, sometimes it's a little hard to cover all of that, but you do have the coverage. So it doesn't come up where it's sitting all the way up in there. 
You don't have to worry about if anything's going to fall out the bottom. And then, of course, you can adjust the front. I like to kind of keep it down a little bit in the front. I'm super excited about this one. Can't wait to see what you guys think. Hopefully, you love the color as much as I do. Let me know what you think of this one. I like this one, but I don't like the fit. It was the pattern and the color for me. And the top, sis. I am so happy with the way this top fits because it definitely, it, does, it doesn't have anything adjusting or any straps, anything like that. But if you don't like really showing your arms as much, then of course you can see that you've got some short sleeves here. You've got the little cutout piece here, which is super cute with the little um, tie detail there. But you also have the little inserts, which I'm not a fan of as much, but these actually are pretty decent size. So they don't bother me as much. And I do love that it comes down a good ways. So it's more of like a crop top. So with that being said, you could get away with this one with maybe a pair of shorts on top of the bathing suit bottom, but it's the fit again for me on the bikini bottoms, okay? With this one, I feel like it's doing the muffin top game again. So I don't know what they gotta get together <laughs> to make sure that they don't put these bottoms that brings out all the roles that we have because we already know they're there. We don't need them to help them come out even more, okay? So anyway, that's the only drawback. As you can see, you definitely getting some muffin top cutoff going on there. And then I don't like whenever it hits right there at my waist too, because again, honestly, you should hopefully have things that kind of cut, cut or come up to the smallest part of your waist as much as possible, or at least not dig in and cut in. So anyway, that's just my personal opinion. I will probably just wear the top and then wear shorts, maybe a cover up, some type of bottoms, uh, skirt even, um, to cover up the bottoms. But yeah, and then of course, this is how the back is looking, which I'm really, again, not a fan of because you don't have enough, there's just not enough coverage here for me. I need it to come here. I know these are here. I'm okay with that. I need you to come up here at least to give me some, cover my booty, okay? <laughs> but anyway, let me know what you guys think. Again, I love the color. I love the pattern but it's the bottoms, it's just a no for me. So, but you guys let me know what you think. Okay, beauty, so let's get into this next look. I love the color combination. I thought it was black on the website, but it actually is a dark navy blue with the green and the red detail on the flowers. So really love that. This kimono is a little thinner. It's a little bit more sheer see-through than the previous one, which I do like because it's a little cooler. So if you're getting into the summertime, this will be a really nice uh, look if these are still available by the summertime. I'm gonna tell you, you know how she and be selling out. So I brought you guys this early so we can jump on it and get ahead of the game because some of this stuff sells out so fast. But anyway, Wanted to show you the link. Um, it's not, of course, as you can see, the floor link style for length, um, but I think it's still super cute because it's kind of short enough where it just kind of barely brushes the back of your knees. I always kind of like to cover that part up if I can, but if not, again, we're gonna just go ahead and rock anyway because we are all about loving all the curves this season, okay? It's hot girl season for the big girls too, okay? <laughs> love, love, love this. The bathing suit is a one-piece halter, as you can see, so I'll go ahead and take this off. And I would say this one is pretty fupa friendly. So this one, as you can see, the one piece, you do have the cutout detail here with the little string that ties to keep the girls together and upright. And of course, you got the halter too. Again, inserts in this, but it's all good. And then as far as the back, you got a good bit of coverage there. I'm not really a big fan of anything that's gonna have me all hanging out. I ain't got time for that, okay? <laughs> what the back looks like, as I said, you got the halter, halter neck, and yeah. Thought this one was super cute. Love the color. Feels very comfortable. I don't feel like I got anything hanging out unnecessarily. It could be a little bit looser because you do still have that little demarcation, I guess you could call it, there. But once you put the kimono on, of course, you don't have to worry about it. But overall, it's still pretty comfortable, so I think I will probably be happy with this one. So let me know what you guys think of this look. I really, really, really wanted this one to understand the assignment. Because when I saw this one on the website, 
the color it was the color for me it was the top being different from the bottom and the pattern on the bottom just it was all of that for me but no she didn't understand the assignment and the size that she was supposed to be because i think with this one you're gonna definitely want to size up um it's just it's just demarcation going on all over the place with this one okay the top i'm not even that busty and this one i tried loosening it i tried tightening it and unless you like for you to have the spillage coming out which most people don't usually yeah i got spillage going on here because this coverage is not giving what i needed to give um if i tight if i loosen it then it comes down and it's not really giving what it needs to give in that area either um i do love the detail the color the pattern everything is perfect but the fit is a no for me okay because again muffin top going on here demarcation going on all over the place in here and then it doesn't get any better in the back <laughs> uh except it comes up to give me a full coverage but it's cutting off here it's just this is doing too much i'm not really feeling it so i don't know again i love the look if you go for this one just size up is my recommendation and hopefully you'll feel a little bit more comfortable but i took an l on this one for you guys because i really hoped that this would work doesn't work in this size but i don't know if i'm gonna reorder in a bigger size just because i have a, a lot of other ones that do work so i might just go with those and if i wear this one i might just wear it with some type of cover-up and still pull it off anyway because it is super cute if i loosen it up maybe i can make it work so let me know what you guys think about this one as far as the look because we all know the fit is not fitting okay <laughs> okay beauties so we're gonna get back to some positives okay because that last one she didn't work out too well but this one this is what i'm talking about okay so classy i love the black and white i love just a nice classic print i love that this is a two-piece but it does show a little something something just to give them a little something to think about but without doing too much which i appreciate i love this one because it does have kind of more of a halter neckline the pattern is like you, as I said, the black and white print that's nice and classy. You do have the little bit of cutout here, but not too much. And again, you got the nice little opening. So if you're not quite comfortable doing a two piece, at least this kind of gives you almost like the illusion of the two piece effect. And then it does have a really good fit. It has good coverage. Unfortunately, it does have a little bit of that demarcation because it is kind of a little bit snug in this area but not too bad. It's nice and super friendly, so I don't feel uncomfortable at all in this one. And in the back, I love this crisscross detail that you see here, so I think that's super cute. It gives a little bit of something going on in the back versus just being plain, because you can see everything else. This is all the one piece. And again, nice and full coverage that I think we can all appreciate, especially a day at the beach when you're out and uncomfortable. This actually should give you a nice little comfortable feeling. So let me know what you guys think of this look. I personally think this is a definitely a, a win. Nice and conservative, simple, classy, but still very cute. So let me know what you guys think about this beauty. So this one is a hit and a miss, okay? When I tell you, I was so excited when I pulled this one out because I was really looking forward to this one. Something about this one is giving me island girl vibes. So shout out to my Caribbean queens out there. This one, for some reason, I don't know, I'm getting that vibe. I love the detail around the waist here at the bra, at the bottom of the top and around the bottom or top of the bottom. If I can say those, <laughs> get those out. But anyway, there's like this uh, sequin pattern that is this nice, beautiful gold pattern on the top and the bottom piece. And the fit actually is not bad for me personally um, with the cup size. I think even if you were larger busted than me, I think you still be comfortable with the top part. It's the bottom that's the miss for me because as much as I love this pattern, it is giving me some serious demar demarcation. And I'm not really feeling that because it's just, it's muffin topping all over the place. And she's just, She's just not giving what I need her to give in through here, okay? Um, it is just all one piece in the back here. 
and down here really with this one and it's not enough coverage for me either I feel really uncomfortable with this one but I think if you had a nice black cover-up you could probably play all that off which I think I probably will do because this here is just giving so it's a hit and a miss but overall I think I probably still keep this one and probably still wear it because I just love this sequin detail here with the gold you got the little split here and the cup is actually or the top actually fits pretty comfortably so let me know what you guys think is it a hit a miss or both for you guys so let me know what you think in the comments okay beauty so i'm from the school of thought of i'll try almost anything at least once and i think this is one of those instances so i personally have never worn a two-piece with this style bikini top before, but because it has this super cute cover up, I figured I'll give it a try at least once. So if you are bold enough to try it with me, I'm right there with you sis, okay? Because this look is so cute. Oh my goodness. I honestly just, I never really would have thought that I could pull off this particular style. It is a three-piece set, so you've got this beautiful cover-up. It is intentionally not gonna cover you all the way up here, okay? So if you go for this one, just be prepared that your girls are definitely gonna be out, okay? But again, if you're not scared, I'm not either, okay? So anyway, this one has, as you can see, the string bikini top, um, but it's the pattern, it's the colors, it's the whole, everything for me the only thing is it's a little short so that was one thing but you do have the string here you can either pull it up tight or you can just keep that pulled down so you do have that it helps with giving you a little bit of a ruching i guess if you want it i guess you could wear it up kind of on the side which is kind of cute too of course if you tied it but anyway just wanted to kind of show you it is a nice sheer very comfortable my arms don't feel suffocated at all so that's a good thing because again we know the sis with the big arms you won't be suffocating because i'm very comfortable and these girls are pretty big again definitely got the bikini cover but as you can see thankfully she had thought about us on the curve for this one because it does have a decent cup size and of course you can pull that in in the middle if you want it to um, I'll take the cover off, off so you can see the rest of the set. I will say if I wear this, it definitely would be with the cover up because it does have that demarcation type thing going on, but it's not super bad, especially I don't think it shows as much with the cover up. And just so you can get a feel for the back, I'm gonna pull it down as far as it'll go. And you can see it is pretty short, but I mean, it's still giving. Okay, so as you can see, definitely still not that scary. I will be honest, I was a little nervous because I was like, ooh, I don't know about a string bikini, but it's okay because it's a teeny weeny patterned bikini, but it's still super cute. Again, as I said, you do have that muffin top demarcation kind of going on, but it's all good. At least you do have a pretty decent amount of coverage in the back there, so everything's not falling out. If it's for you, do you boo okay but i just don't like to have all my booty hanging out so and then as you can see it is a straight literally a straight bikini with the halter top so yeah again if you are bold enough to try it let me know in the comments because i will rock it right there with you okay <laughs> but overall i do think this is a cute look and i can't wait to hear what you guys think or see what you guys think in the comments that is the end of the video the try on haul for today hopefully you guys really enjoyed it i had so much fun making this video for you guys definitely interested in trying all these different looks over the spring and summer now i just got to find some vacations to book to be able to wear these different looks okay if you haven't already and you watched this far make sure you please subscribe to the channel and join the goddess community you will love it here every week we talk about fashion we do a little bit of beauty we talk about some lifestyle things so if you're into that kind of thing and the plus size lifestyle then make sure you join the family by clicking subscribe make sure you also hit that like button so that way it'll be shared out to more of us beauties and that way other people can get ideas for some different swimwear for plus size bodies as well and make sure you leave me a comment let me know what your favorite look was of course i can't end this video without making sure that i shot out the comment of the week from last week's video shout out to this comment of the week thank you so so much 
for this comment. It always makes my day when I see all your comments, especially one like this. If you haven't seen last week's video, make sure you go watch it because there was definitely something you needed to see if you haven't. And that's gonna be the giveaway for Reaching 2K subscribers. So make sure you go watch the video, it was a vlog. And that was for the spring break vlog. So depending on what day you watch this video, make sure you go find that one because the uh, giveaway will end on April the 14th, I believe. I'll have the information in the description box below. And if you love the flowers from Rose Forever at the beginning of the video, again, they're the sponsor for today's video. So make sure if you wanna order your flowers for you or a loved one, make sure you check the description box below for that coupon code, Big Brown Goddess 15 we use you $15 off. And until next time, thank you guys so much for watching. See you next week or next video.